And we saw a lot of crazy swings from Bryson DeChambeau and Patrick Cantlay in that playoff this past week. What did you see as it was going down? Because it looked like it was Bryson's for a long time. Then it looked like it was Cantlay's when he found the water. And it eventually became the guy that was putting so well. So, Shane, I think this is why golf is the best in-play betting sport in the world because there are so many swings, there's so much back and forth, but there's also a bit of time to breathe in between the back and forth. And with Cantlay and Bryson, the chaos really started on the 17th hole when Cantlay hits it into the water. At that point, he goes out to plus 2,900, which means that he's about a 3% chance to win the tournament at that point. But at that point, Cantlay then turns into basically 1993 Michael Jordan and uh, can't miss a putt from then on. On the 18th hole, the shot that he made uh, to, ma to make birdie and force the playoff, uh, that was uh, basically a 12% chance for him to make that. And then throughout the playoff, there was even more back and forth where when Bryson finds the water, uh, then Cantlay goes into a minus 1,000 favourite. Uh, and then, you know, they go back to even when Bryson saves par and then Cantlay ultimately goes on to win. And I know a lot of people have been criticising Bryson for some missed putts that would have won the tournament. But for the most part, he was missing 18 footers and that's less than a 20% chance to make them but I think the one that will stick with Bryson is that that second hole of the playoff uh, where he had that six footer and that's almost a 70% chance that you should make that so that's the one that, that really got away from him.